What do you think, Eric? Look pretty good up there? Yeah, I think so, Coach. In our football program here at Rutgers, we talk about family. Families stick together, families stay together. There has been no more inspirational person in our program's history than Eric Legrand. He is the greatest symbol we have of perseverance. And without a doubt, it is only fitting that he be the first football player in the history of our program, 144 years, to have his number retired. Welcome back to Rutgers Halftime. Eric Legrand's jersey retirement ceremony here. Let's listen in. Now, I promised Eric a few surprises. On behalf of our program and behalf of, of our university, I'd like to present Eric with this sword. Something a true not scholar, something a true scholar knight should have. The first and only of its kind. It has his number and the word believe right on the blade. And for those that are behind me, you'll be able to see it clearly. For those that are in front of me, you may have to turn around. But the biggest of all surprise we have is right up there in the film box. If we could drop that sheet. Number 52 will be displayed in our stadium, as it should be. If everybody would now turn their attention to the scoreboard. Big E, sorry I couldn't be there, buddy, but congratulations, what a great honor. More than much deserved. You know what, to be the first player in Rutgers football history to have their number retired is something special, and you deserve it. Keep living the way you are, man. You inspire all of us. Love you, buddy. And I just want to tell Big E, congratulations. We believe. Keep on the hard work and keep chopping. Congrats, Big E. Uh, you've been a Rutgers legend for a long time, and now you'll go down in history. This is a, a big deal, and I couldn't think of anyone as important as you to go down and have their jersey retired. Hey Eric, congratulations. Um, you make me proud to be a Rutgers football player. And it was a joy being your teammate, but you're an even better friend. I mean, the first number in Rutgers history to be retired, that's a, a great accomplishment. And you know, we all can't wait to see the day that you walk onto that field and leave the team out the tunnel. Congratulations again. Eric, congratulations. To be the first football player in 144 years to have your jersey retired is amazing. We couldn't be more proud of you. We believe in you. And on behalf of Rutgers University, congratulations. Just want to congratulate you, Eric Legrand, on getting your number retired, the Big 52. I know it's a big honor for you, and to be the first one to ever do it, of course it would have to be you. Just want to congratulate and get your number retired. That's a true honor. You know, every time I step out in that field, I think about you and the words you say and, uh, you know, the inspiration you give me to go out there and play the game I love. Eric, congratulations on this special day. Being the only Rutgers football player to ever have his jersey retired is a reflection of the special person that you are. I appreciate having the privilege to be a part of your life and you a part of mine, and I wish you the very best. You inspire everybody you touch. You're the model of courage. The Pernetti family loves you, and we've always got your back. We believe in you, Eric. Enjoy your big day. You deserve it. Congratulations. Uh, you've been an inspiration to us all, and very deserving of this honor. Congratulations. Big E, congratulations on being the first ever Rutgers football player with his number to be retired. Can't think of a better way to inspire the team than to look up in the rafters and see your number out there every week. 
We're all proud of you, and uh, we believe. Hi, I'm Rich Ellerson, the head football coach at the United States Military Academy at West Point. I want to congratulate our friend Eric Legrand, the first football player in 144 years of football to have his number retired at Rutgers. Congratulations. You're doing great things. Big E, just want to say congratulations. Uh, this couldn't happen to a better person and a better football player. Uh, nobody deserves it more than you. And truly, you inspire me every single day to go out there and just work hard. Because I know if you were inside my shoes, you'll make the best of it. I love you, big bro. Eric, I just want to say, man, you're a true inspiration uh, to go out there each and every day. And you inspire so many. Uh, congratulations on this great honor. Uh, you're a true definition of a guy that kept on chopping. Just want to let you know, down in Chicago, I love you, man. I miss you. Uh, you're my hero. And, uh, you know, just keep chopping. Keep fighting, man. We praying for you and we still believe in you. you know, it's, it's amazing to see how, how many people you've inspired and, and how much you've impacted the world on, on your words of wisdom. You know, it's great to see you doing great things for the world and, and touching many hearts. It's been an honor playing with you and it's been an honor following your story. You give me an inspiration to keep going every day, man. Keep believing. Uh, congratulations, Big E. Uh, keep chopping. Eric, you've been an inspiration to a lot of people. Keep it up. Colonia community is proud of you, the Rutgers community is proud of you, and every person that lives and breathes is proud of you. Thank you for everything you've done for us. Appreciate all that you've done for everybody and uh, everybody in football, and uh, congratulations and good luck in the future. Big E, man, congratulations on having your jersey retired. You've been an inspiration to many of us out here. Hey, Big E, congratulations, my man. We love you, we support you, we are so proud of you. And listen, man, we all believe in you. Okay, pal? Keep chopping. Can't wait to see you. You truly embody on what it is to be a Scarlet Knight. And it's an honor to have known you, become a great friend, and to walk by your side. Congratulations, Eric. I'm proud to be the head football coach at Rutgers as we retire your number. The first number in 144 years of football history to ever be retired. I'm even prouder to call you my friend. Today is your day, and you deserve every minute of it. But my day will be the one when you go back to MetLife. Stand up off that field and walk off the way you should, and I get to unretire your number. Eric, I love you. Eric, we believe. I want to thank everybody for coming today. You know, this really means the world to me. You know, all my years I got to play football, from the time I was five until I was 20. I put my blood, my sweat, my tears, my enthusiasm, everything that I had, I sacrificed for this game. And to know now that that 52, is hanging in the stadium for me, my family, my friends, everybody, Rutgers. We're all here today. This is all for you guys, too. But now I really want to get into something important. All the people I get to see every day that are going through the same situation as me in a wheelchair, paralyzed. You know, I'm the spokesperson for them. I go to therapy every day. I work my butt off to get on my feet, you know? But those people, those people don't get the notoriety that I do. They're grinding just as hard as me. And I'm here for them. And that's one of my reasons I started Team LeGrand that partnered with the Christopher and Dana Reed Foundation. And I'm here today to announce that and try to get that for them, to know that they have that support. You guys are supporting them. I'm supporting them. But without you guys, we need the funding. We need the donations. It's all from you guys. Without you, without me, we won't be able to walk again. We are so close to a cure for paralysis. 
all it takes is funding. If you guys can go to teamlegrand.org slash join and join my team or go to the text messages and donate to my foundation. That's all we need. All those people that are sitting in this chair that don't have the platform that I do to talk to you guys. This is the time. I need all of you, whatever you can do, donate, join my team, and let me live my, my dream to go back to MetLife Stadium where I went down and finished my play and run off that fear like I said I would. And if it was not for you guys, I would not be able to do it. Listen, I know you guys can do it. Without you guys, I would not be where I am today. I'm very fortunate. All the doctors told me I would never be able to come off a ventilator, but never be able to eat solid foods. We'll never be able to sit here talking to you guys. But you see me here today with my jersey retired, living my life to the fullest. And without you guys, I never would have been able to do it. Each and every day, I wake up, I read my Twitter, my Facebook, and all the nice things you guys say to me, motivating me to do what I do every day. You know, I could easily just sit in my bed and rock, but no, I make that the decision every day to get back on my feet, my feet and go to therapy and do the things that I can do. And without you guys, it is truly in me to say, I would not be able to, to, to do it. And I hope you guys continue to support me. Thank you all, my fans, my family, my friends, my therapists, everyone that's here today. Thank you all. And like I said, please join Team LeGrand and help me get back on my feet and walk again. And always remember, each and every day, believe, because it's in me, and it's in you guys too. Let's do this. Thank you again. Eric LeGrand.